Quick changeovers in the world of manufacturing means everything. Now on a mill, you have 20, 30, 50, 300 tools in your tool changer. But what do you do when you're working on a two axis lathe or a lathe with live tooling, but you're not on a full mill turn center yet. So you don't have that giant carousel that you can make expandable. What are your options? Well, one of the best options I've seen to date is the Sandvik Cormont Capto system. They were the pioneers of this quick change system. It makes tool changes as simple as throwing a leaf and coming back and your tool is changed out. So if you have a look at the picture back here, you can see they've got live driven tools, they've got static tools, they've got quick change positions, they've got side mounted boring bars. They've got a little bit of everything in this setup actually. And it's just really phenomenal. Like just look at that. Looks like they've got the half index positions, but they actually aren't using them with this Capto system. With Capto, you can take advantage of that as well. They do have the half change index systems. However, that does reduce the size of tool that you can hold. So the customer in this case has gone for the larger tools with the less positions. The beautiful thing about this Capto change system is if you've got one radial driven tool, you can go from spot to drill to tap in those R&D environments where you only have one driven radial or axial holder. Instead of investing in multiple units, you just have an open door command, an M0 in there, change the tool over, or in the case of say down in this bottom holder where they've got the tap right now, if that was a ginormous boring bar that would typically limit the proximity you can get the turret to the spindle, you would then be able to pull that large bar out after an M00 and not worry about burying it in by your spindle wall. These systems just save so much time and increase your versatility, whether you're in high run OEM production or you're in short run R&D and small runs, being able to change over quickly is what's gonna make you competitive. Capto system from Sandvik Coromont is above all the other systems I've had. If you've seen a more efficient system, I would love to learn about it in the comments below. Drop that down there. What systems have you seen that are more efficient that aren't based on the Capto innovations from Sandvik? I've yet to see anything, although I'm always willing to learn. What's your favorite setup reduction strategy for lathes? Drop that in the comment below and don't forget to keep your spindles turning and earning.